Welcome back to Troid Met. Like that mm. music. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, yeah. As previously established, this game doesn't really have a soundtrack. <laughs> so weird, especially on the 8-bit soundtrack. Well, what That's they're so going for, what the, what the, they're the, what they're going for is they're trying to like uh create an ambiance. Yeah. But the thing is any form of ambiance that existed in what this game what year did this game come out like 81 or sorry Probably. 91 um like any I form of like ambiance created by that just does not exist anymore <laughs> no because we're so used to hearing you know actual ambiance actual ambiance <laughs> but this fucking it would be real is not yeah it's not is not i did not I now mean, that's, like, add that to the list of the reasons why uh, it's a good thing we have a remake on 3DS now. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So I was to say, it kind of gives me a, a, a much more, um, oh, what's the word, like, raw version, I guess, of um, the ambient music in Mother 2 at the end. You're right, we are watching the Raws. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Watching the, WWE Raw. You see, you see. Know what you, yeah. watching. you mentioned you I mentioned Ambience and uh, Mother Two, and the, like the first thing that enters my mind is just those uh, like sirens you hear everywhere in that game that just going like. Oh yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah, like, exactly. Because that's all over Mother Two's soundtrack. <laughs> it's it's cool. in a little of Mother 3's soundtrack as well, but to a lesser extent. Mm-hmm. Um, I miss those jumping pancake guys. Jumping pancake guys. I miss them. They oh, got these oh weird yeah, they've jumping, been replaced by these jump, jump, jumping squid guys. Oh yeah, yeah, I know. I was gonna call about. them Octoroks, but jump, jumping Octoroks. Octorok. I'm so hungry. I can eat an Octorok. <laughs> you ever just like get in the mood to watch old YouTube poops again? Yeah. No. Yeah, oh, it's like. Her. I don't know why it always happens like near the end of the year. Whenever I have that that itch. Did you know it. that like about a month, about a month and a half ago, Walrus Guy uploaded a new YouTube poop. Holy shit! Yeah, it's just a small one, and it's ma basically like the whole joke is that it's like tying thing, like like he takes like a line from one source and then ties it to something slightly related from a different source, so it's not as wild as his usual stuff, but. Better known to you as Walrus Guy. <clears throat> I felt like the older YouTube poops for me were almost a little too wild. Like, there was so much going on, it was just dis more disorienting than I funny I feel like sometimes. they've just gotten more wild over the years. Well, I've, I haven't watched them since I was in maybe 6th grade. Mm -hmm. So, that would it. be like... 15 years ago? Yeah, there's a lot less, like... like Modern day YouTube poops are um, very... Uh, I, I'd say, like, I'd say... Yeah, just in general, they're um, a lot less predictable because uh, n not everyone is using the um, not everyone is using the uh, the same uh, the same like the same jokes, the same like and yeah. like the same audio sources and stuff. Like in like say two thousand seven, two thousand eight, like every YouTube poop would have like a bit where uh, like. For example, you'd hear dinner or spaghetti, but that's yep. not just like yep. it, there, there aren't those consistencies anymore. People make what they want. I imagine meme culture, uh, the way that it's proliferated, especially in the recent years, has might likely influence them. Yeah, yeah, meme culture has really changed because back then there were like there were there were about twelve memes, and they just kind of like permeated for a year, if not longer, and now it's just the meme of the month. <laughs> Yeah. There were 12 memes, and I had to go to the library and look them up and open the book. This conversation. Jesus and, Jesus and his uh, 12 meme disciples. Yeah. <laughs> They're all the Rage comics. That's it. <laughs> God. You know, I just kind of skipped over Rage comics. I'd like to. Uh, I thought the serial guy was funny. Um, I mean, I guess, I guess, I guess they kind of yeah. came back with Wojax. Yeah, well, especially because the main money. one, like the main one, was already a rage face. Yeah, I think the the whole there was a time last year when people would like attribute the troll face to like an eldritch horror, mm -hmm. um, and that the weird like horror posting like 
be me, like, blah, 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 and it would end with, like, uh, it'd be, like, Aurora Woods incident, uh, March 8th, 2021. <laughs> it'd just be, like, weirdly, like, realistic situations and, like, date. I don't know. It was horror. <laughs> um... But, uh, this conversation really cool. has me feeling old. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like a boomer. If you're five what? years younger than I am. We're all hey, in our 20s. Yeah. <laughs> Carrie, yeah, I know. But guess what? You're five years older than me, so whatever. Oh, oh man, sick burn. I don't want to hear it. Is that a burn? <laughs> no, it's, it's just the truth. No, I, it is a burn because I'm Miami Heat. <laughs> ah! <laughs> He is Miami Heat, after all. I am, I am the Miami Heat. in fact his new Discord name. I am the entire team. Uh, if I were to pick a time frame of which Miami Heat I would be, uh, probably 2000... Oh four heat, yeah, that's. So uh, you're Miami Heat, but you're only one iteration of the team. You're yes, not. You're yes, not yes. the entirety am, of the team. I am. I am Wait, the team that won the NBA final. But that's uh, that's the year that uh, that's the year that Mario Kart Double Dash came out. Yeah, oh, you can't have um, Miami Heat and Mario Kart Double Dash in the same year. That's illegal. It's in the Constitution. <laughs> ah, yeah, our founding fathers. Yeah, um, yeah. That around said, this country sure will not be. Conceptualized so, basketball and video games. So to talk about the game for a few minutes, um, yes. oh, yeah. starting we'll around this point in the game, uh, with one exception in, I want to say the next part, uh, the game just gets much linear. Um, like, so this part, we actually cover two areas instead of just one, because the last area we were in, uh, it was, um, so... That was just an alpha, by the way, not a not a yeah. gamma. But um, more like a beta. There are no beta Metroids. Um, uh, anyway, see the that last area we were in uh only had a single Metroid in it, and then the lava went down. But it wasn't the lava for the area to progress; it was the lava to another area that like was like right next to the first one, um, which leads to two more Metroids. But that means that there were only three Metroids we are killing in this part. And, like, it's just this extremely straight tunnel, which, as, yeah, you can actually see where the uh, deviation is, and it's where the two shells well. are. Um, this is the most linear Metroid game ever made. Mm -hmm. We just appreciate that earlier you said it becomes m much linear. Oh, I meant to say m much more linear. I, I, I appreciate your combination of the words more and linear and, and, and just shortening it to simply linear. Uh, yeah, because, you know, um... Very straight, much linear. It becomes, it, it, memes, it, it, memes. <laughs> it becomes much linear, or in other words, it becomes much linear. more linear. 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 Yep. It is very yep. linear. Yeah, yeah. very, very linear. <laughs> mm -hmm. You could almost say like... it's a line. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it. A linear... Dude, that's mm -hmm. so funny. Yeah. Yeah, it is. I only linear. Me, me when I me when I uh uh have a line that connects two ends of a circle together, real chord moment. It's almost as if I'm some sort of famous comedian or something. Wow. Dude. Um, fucking Kevin Hart. Is I that don't you? Know Brian. Does oh, he even do yeah. com comedy anymore? He's not funny. Uh, he no, I don't know. Uh, no, that's, no that's, he never did carry. <laughs> he never did carry. He never was funny. Did I'm you sorry. know that Conan O'Brien used to write? I know. I don't watch comedy. Did you know that Conan O'Brien used to write for The Simpsons? I did. That's huh. that's everyone would have, people would always be like, oh look, watch early Simpsons episodes, and they do the the Wojak pointing meme when yeah. they see his name, like, oh, it's Conan O'Brien. Okay, I've not seen that meme, but. Oh, or I've not seen that variation of that meme more specifically. Probably Simpsons was funny, so you could say he was funny then. Yeah. Yeah. No. I only know it's funny because Evan showed me some episodes. I'm not yeah. an avid Simpsons watcher, but I do enjoy the ones he showed me. Yeah. Hey, look a drone. Bye. Man, that guy's just. Well, he's not gaming anymore. He <laughs> he's a strawberry. Not he's a. <laughs> hmm. Me when... You know, I gotta say, despite the fact that this is apparently the homeworld of the Metroids, uh, the ecosystem seems to be doing fairly well for itself. Yeah. 
Yeah, there's a lot going on. I mean, there don't really seem to be many plants, but I guess it's not necessary for this sort of life. Yeah, this is like, this is like just, this is like all rock caverns here, but there's like, there's life. And even though Metroid's main thing is latching onto you and absorbing your life energy. <laughs> Maybe they did that with all the grass and plants. Oh. And this but is all. And that implies that they do utilize the sunlight in order to uh, flourish. But if there's none left and they're still flourishing, they must utilize. Well, a different it form doesn't of make energy. sense for there to be plant life in here because again, we're in we're in rock caverns. You know, there's Are no we... sunlight to be heard of. Carrie, yeah, it's and so they must get their energy grass. elsewhere. It's space hmm? grass. It probably applies space by grass? different rules. Yeah. Well, space where does grass. the space grass get its energy from? Like gamma rays or something? I thought you said gamer rays. Instead of gamer UV rays. rays. <laughs> gamer rays. Do you drink Gamerade? I do. Gamerade. Yes. <laughs> I wake up in the morning and What's I your say, favorite oh, flavor of Gamerade? Uh E Girl Piss. <laughs> no. <laughs> no! <laughs> Did you say that? Yeah. Uh my favorite flavor is uh <laughs> misplaced. Racially charged insult. <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> misplaced. Um, yeah. uh, I, I, I don't know, that feels like it's kind of, I don't know, it just kind of feels like they're copying pasting the flavor of heated gaming moment. <laughs> yeah, from the other company, um, uh, oh, yes. Yes. Uh, uh, uh I was gonna make a, a PewDiePie joke, but I don't know how to tie it in to another energy drink brand. That's okay, you can do what you want. PewDiePie isn't funny. That's true. <laughs> How's it going, bros? My name is PewDiePie. It's 2010. Fist bumps the camera. <laughs> yeah, that was a while ago, wasn't it? Yeah, quite, quite a bit, yeah. It's been God more than damn, a decade that was ago. 12 years ago. Oh my god. A decade ago. Oh my god, my YouTube account's twelve year gonna be twelve years old in this summer. <laughs> Next time on Smash Team Games, uh we become very old people. It's almost a team. <laughs>